With us today, Archbishop Zevelod from the Ukrainian Orthodox Church in the USA. Uh, I'm Archbishop Zevelod in Greek Pankrati of the Ukrainian Orthodox Church here in the United States. I was ordained by his uh, eminence, the blessed memory Archbishop Yakovos, and uh, for many years I had been involved in various dialogues with the uh, Catholic Church. Uh, our Patriarch, His All Holiness Patriarch Bartolomeo, is very, very interested and very anxious to continue this dialogue on the international level. Recently he has appointed uh, several prominent metropolitans to lead the uh, continue the dialogue with the Catholic Church. The Metropolitan is one of the famous uh, theologians, Ioannis of Pergamon. I myself have been involved in the dialogue for many years. As a bishop, I am a member of the Orthodox Catholic Dialogue here in the United States for the last 20 years. I was also a sponsor and creator of Kiev Study Group, which we meet with the blessings and sanction of this All Holiness, the Patriarch Bartolomeo. Um, our first meeting was in Oxford, and we continue it for many years until we, with Mr. Fiegel, established this uh, Oriental Lumen, which is very unique in itself because here we have the participation not only of the Orthodox Catholic, but also the um, uh, Eastern Catholics and the laity. So not only the theologians and clergy, but here we have also the exposure to the laity that can participate in the various important uh, issues. After the Vatican II, we have come very close to the um, rapprochement with the Catholic Church. There are still many obstacles on which we are working hard on both sides to overcome, and I envisage that inevitably there will be a unity and one chalice among us. You said in one of your talks that the dawn of unity is upon us. How do you see that coming? Is it in our time? Is it future generation? Well, I cannot foresee the future, but I can uh, sense that there is an urgency and because we are living now in the times when the communication is so feasible internet uh, fax radio we are communicating instantly and our communication our dialogue what happens here today is already known about the whole world so i feel that because of this technological development and above all, because of the desire of the people, not only the clergy and theologians, but the desire of people to, to have a, 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 a one church and be united is as most important. And I feel that that's why the desire of the common people will bring us sooner to one uh, one unity that we so desire. Thank you very, very much, Archbishop. Thank you very much.